Manatee deputies are still investigating a deadly shooting after a group of armed men entered a home on 64th Avenue in Bradenton. SNN's Crystal Knowles has the latest. We speak to one of the victim's sons off camera and he said he was in shock to find his dad laying shot on the driveway. It all happened around 1030 last night when deputies responded to a 911 call about a home invasion. A group of armed men entered this home and got into an argument with the homeowner, 38-year-old Alan Perkins. That's when gunshots were fired, hitting one of the suspects, 27-year-old Emmanuel Johnson, and Perkins was also shot multiple times, including the face. Shots were exchanged, multiple gunfire. At the time of the shooting, two of Perkins' son were at home and they hid from the bullets while his wife and his other son were at the store. But when she got home and saw what was going on, she took matters into her own hands. One of the victims actually had her gun out and was holding it on one of the suspects. And it turned out to be the suspect who later died. According to Dave Bristow, public information officer for the Manatee County Sheriff's Office, this wasn't a random act. This residence was targeted. There was a reason they came here. As investigators gather the remaining evidence and start putting the pieces together. It'll become really clear why they came to this residence. Neighbors we spoke to say there's more to this story and are not surprised this happens. Bristow says this was a planned attack. They're not going to come to a normal residence and do what they did here. The victim is in serious condition but is expected to survive. In Bradenton, Crystal Knowles, SNN, Suncoast News Network. Deputies say they're still looking for two to three suspects and are following multiple leads.